Ken, what were you, all the nerves when you walked onto the Jeopardy set for the first time being the guest host, what were you thinking? I have, I don't think I've been more nervous in my life. The chase is a cakewalk compared to having to, to having to host Jeopardy just because it's nerve wracking to know the, the legacy and the, you know, the size of the shoes you're filling. Just to be frank, nobody wants me there. I don't want me there. We all want to see Alex there for a hundred years, you know, in a perfect world. And, uh, you know, I really just wanted to, to do the best I could so as not to let him down, you know, and, and Jeopardy viewers down. So I felt a lot of pressure. Do you remember the last time you did speak to Alex? I actually talked to him on the phone um, the same weekend he, he passed. We had talked about the possibility of me guest hosting for him at some point. And he was so sweet, you know, he was, he was just, he was thanking me very, very uh, genuinely for helping out. And I was like, Alex, we, you gave us 37 years, you know, we should be thanking you. It's, it's the least I can do. What, what do you think his report card would be after you've now guest host? What would he say about your performance? Jeez, that's brutal. Uh, Alex yeah. took his job very seriously, and I don't believe he would be grading me on a curve, you know? I think he would have some, some serious words on stuff I needed to work on, you know? Hopefully a C plus.